Hi guys, welcome to another video and this specific tutorial is going to be um, dedicated for people who are more into KDP, coring books, coring pages rather than um, other POD sellers who for example mostly work on Redbubble, TeePublic or Merge by Amazon. Um, but please remember that I strongly believe KDP is one of the best options you can do in order to make some passive income, let's say passive income, like no matter how you want to call it, just making income online. So KDP uh, is super strong option. So on uh, Match by Amazon, you need to apply for your account to be active. On the other hand, um, on KDP, you just need to register your account, connect your bank account and then you're ready to go. And in this video, I want to really quickly show you how you can use um, nowadays AI tools in order to create super good looking coring pages in seconds. And I believe there is still a war between Leonardo AI and Midjourney. These are two of the most popular tools for creating AI arts, AI graphics that can be sold uh, on print on demand websites. And generally by testing both of them, I had an active subscription on Midjourney for a couple of months. Now I'm using Leonardo AI. Generally, after some months of work, I strongly believe that Leonardo AI is nowadays better and comparing the prices to the quality of what you get, Leonardo AI is simply um, better to use, cheaper, and the quality is identical and sometimes even better than Midjourney. So we're gonna focus specifically on creating some coloring pages today for your KDP account. And as you can see, I've already generated some images. I'm gonna show you like the prompt I believed works the best, what you need to have checked on here, uh, what you don't. Um, we're gonna compare a little bit prices between Leonardo AI and Midjourney. And as the last step, I'm going to show you how you can increase a bit uh, quality of the scoring pages from Leonardo AI so they are better to color. Uh, this is super simple stuff, so very quick tutorial today. <clears throat> but okay, uh, first the bull, like comparing the prices because that's going to be a good starting point of this video. On Midjourney, uh, you have a basic plan for $10 a month. A standard plan is uh, much more expensive, so probably not a lot of you are going to go uh, for a standard plan. That's why I'm going to discuss mainly the uh, cheapest plan. So on Midjourney, this is a basic plan which is $10 a month and it lets you generate around 200 to maybe 250, 300, maybe at most like 350 to 400 graphics. Um, that is it. If you're gonna run out of fast hours, you don't have any relaxed GPU time, so you cannot generate any graphics anymore after like using um, all of this fast GPU time. On the other hand, on the Leonardo AI, uh, you have also a free version. So um, usually you get 150 uh, tokens because here um, you don't have something which is called fast hours like on Midjourney, but instead you get tokens which are used to create um, some AI art. So for the cheapest plan, comparing to Midjourney where the cheapest plan was $10, here it is $12 and it gives you around, not around, but exactly 8,500 tokens per month, which are going to be uh, reset after the ending month period and how it converts into the number of images. From what I calculated is more or less three times more than Midjourney offers. So it's gonna be around 1000 to 1500 different images. All right, and let's right now continue with the Leonardo to create some coloring pages. All right, so after you are familiar with the prices and why I do think uh, Leonardo AI is much cheaper, uh, we can continue with creating such coloring pages. So first of all, we're gonna start with the prompt and settings in order to have like the more or less same quality which is on Midjourney. Because if you don't know, Midjourney has like outstanding quality for coloring pages and this is really hard to copy on the other website. So most of these AI generators simply do not work as good as Midjourney. For example, I have like the same object here which was generated in Midjourney. So it, this is a treehouse coloring page and we will try to generate something similar here on Leonardo AI. So what I have um, written in the, in the prompt box, treehouse coloring page 
strong black outline, no colors. And you may wonder why this description is so simple. It is not very detailed. And let me tell you this, to get like the best coloring pages you can, I would recommend you to lose, I would recommend you to use Leonardo Diffusion in the dynamic mode with a prompt magic and alchemy mode on. This will give you like the best results. What is prompt magic? We, you can simply read it here that our custom render pipeline that has far greater prompt adherence, higher image fidelity, and can improve the output with any chosen model. Uh, it increases token cost due to the higher GPU overhead. So as you can see, if I'm gonna turn it off, here is the number of tokens that are going to be used for creating some images. Uh, if I'm gonna turn it off, the number of tokens will significantly decrease. <clears throat> but we're gonna have it uh, turned on. And also the alchemy mode, which is like for generating much better looking images. This is a new feature and it works super, super great. Um, the next thing I have checked here is the public images to leave it unchecked. I don't want to share any of my images with, with others. So I believe on mid journey, this is also a paid feature. You get a paid for the like more expensive plan in order to have images only for yourself. The next thing you gotta do is to decrease a bit of height. So I generally leave the width uh, for 512 pixel, but the height needs to be a little bit decreased because we have to achieve this eight and a half per 11 inches proportion, the aspect ratio that is usually used for creating such um, coloring pages on Amazon. All right, we have everything set right now. Uh, the rest can be as it is. And let's now click on generate. We're gonna generate like four images. That's gonna be enough, I believe. And the time of generating such images is more or less the same as it is on mid journey. So, so practically it makes um, no difference and the images have been generated. So these are fantastic images looking super great, but alchemy mode and generally like Leonardo AI has a little bit problems with um, putting no colors. So only black and white colors on these coloring pages. And as you can see here, there is a little bit of gray here on those pages. So how you can actually decrease it um, before this video, I have downloaded one of these coring pages and put it into Canva and you can simply improve it with a very simple tool. Just upload it to Canva, click on edit photo here, click on adjust and we're gonna like play around a bit with the brightness and the contrast and also maybe the shadow or something like that. So first of all, what you want to do, you want to increase brightness just a bit to increase the whites in the photo. So we're going to increase the brightness, maybe like up to 30 or something. As you can see, the image got brightened and the whites are more visible right now. And the next thing we're going to do is to increase the contrast and we're going to do it by a lot. The contrast is generally causing the whites on the image to be even wider and blacks to be even blacker, <laughs> if you know what I mean. So there is a less gray and the colors between black and white. We can do even maybe like 100 or something. And as you can see, the image is instantly uh, much better to color. There is definitely a lot more whites on it. So this is a simple trick. You can obviously uh, still experiment further to even improve this image more, but I believe this one uh, will do the work. All right, guys, so that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it was an uh, informative video that you're going to be able to use for your KDP store. Uh, thank you so much for watching. See you again very, very soon. Have a great rest of your day and bye bye.